What? Mermaid Man, I have all your comics and toys and mail. Uh, huh? What? What? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. Now, what was I supposed to tell you? That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! <laughs> massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! Patrick, you will be saved by the hero SpongeBob. Mermaid Man, SpongeBob is gonna hit you once. Let's take it. Oh, he's mad. Scary, but okay. This is a slide. When SpongeBob, Patrick, or Sandy jump onto a slide, they will sip down the slope at hydrodynamic speed. Oh, cool. Let's do this. What? No way! SpongeBob, really? I know you like to taste stuff all the time, but come on. Your tongue over sand? I mean... That looks great! Uh, shortcut. We got the start. Needs to do laundry. Oh man, you're gonna taste sand for months. Ah. Oh, oh yeah. Patrick will be glad to have this back. You got this, SpongeBob. You need to get to Patrick to help him, but he's unreachable. Maybe these switches will create a way. The robots are guarding them heavenly. You have to battle through. Okay, okay. Find those switches. Need to hit those switches. Let's go, SpongeBob. Hit those switches. You know what to do. Need to break those duplicators. No more robots. High five that thingy. The switch. I mean. Here we go and hammer time. Hammer. I get it. Take that. I take that. Yes. All right. This. Don't get hit by that. There we go. Robot for this one. Close oh. Hit that button. All right. One more button to go. More hammer dudes. You got it, SpongeBob. Gonna jump this. Oh yeah. Do not fall in the goo. And... Ugh. Amazing. Destroy that, yeah. Oh no! Too close, SpongeBob! Oh. <laughs> Luckily there was another sponge. underwear here. Jump down. Destroy this robot. Right. And now we're going to Patrick, I think. What are you doing, SpongeBob? Come on! You need to save Patrick. Come on, you can do this. Yes, there we go. Nice. And there we go. Alright, it's Patrick. Hey, SpongeBob! Hey, SpongeBob! Woo! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? What? Okay. Patrick? What are you saying, SpongeBob? What? We're staring at each other for... The next day. Oh, it's Patrick that needs to move. <gasps> no <gasps> way. <gasps> Amazing. We're playing Patrick. Let's go. We're never gonna change. Come on. What's this? We got a sign here. This is a throw fruit. Patrick can pick up throw fruits and throw them. Of course he can. Press this button to pick up a nearby throw fruit and press again to throw it. Throw fruit can push buttons, destroy tikis, and damage robots. But use it quickly because a throw fruit will after a few seconds. Okay, let's uh, grab this watermelon and throw it at the button. There we go, gate is open. What's happening if we throw it? We can throw it quite far away. But it doesn't float in the goo, so... Okay. 
Patrick can also pick up and throw tickies, but only tickies that don't have another tiki stacked on top of them. All right, I get it. All right, Patrick, grab it and throw it. Nice. Grab another one. And wait a second. Blue heads there. Got it. Oh, there's one over here. And oh, yeah. Nice. Get that jellyfish. There's a lot of signs here. Patrick can throw fruit up steps, then climb the steps, pick up the fruit, and throw it again. But he better hurry before it will. Patrick, you ready? Grab the fruit. Throw the fruit. Jump on the edge. Grab the fruit. Throw the fruit. Jump on the edge. Grab the fruit. Aim the fruit. Throw the fruit. Hit the button. Amazing, Patrick. Amazing. The gates are open. What's this? This is a special Patrick teeter totter that only Patrick can use. Have Patrick pick up and throw fruit, stand on the pink starfish side, then throw the fruit at the target side. Okay. Patrick will then be flung across the other side of the lake. I'm curious. Uh, let's do this. I'm gonna aim it. Oh! <laughs> Woohoo! There you go, Patrick. You're a flying star. <laughs> you know, in space, stars. Jump in here. What's over here? Another sign, of course. This is a thunder tick. When Patrick touches it, it will begin to storm. And after a few seconds, will go boom. <laughs> Don't be near it when it goes boom. Pick it up, Patrick, and throw it in the goo. Yes. Right. Here, jump there. All right. Uh, more of them here. I think pick it up and throw it down. Oh, oh, Patrick. Really? I need my glasses. I thought you are gonna throw it. Oh, well. Read the sign first. Patrick can pick up on the tickies and throw it just like other tickies. But he had better throw it fast. Real sad. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, you barnacle head. Watch where you're going. The rock is talking to me. Almighty oh, rock, I am at your command. Down here, you big pink lummox! Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knock-off wallets. Wallets? What do you mean, wallets? Oh, thank you! Patrick is in on this game, so Patrick thinks he's fine, then I will say it's fine as well. Go, Patrick, make some wallets. If you jump up in the air and press this button, Patrick will slam down to the ground, damaging tickies or pressing buttons below him. Something like... Oh, yeah. That's using your butt, Patrick. Ooh, present everyone! Go, Patrick. Ooh, scary dark cave. Oh, yeah, very scary. Molten lava rocks. Watch out. And they're also round. Very convenient. Oh, watch out. Got this, Patrick. Cannonball! Get a, yeah, cannonball. Get that jellyfish. We hate jellyfish. We hate them. We hate them all. But we have this. And there you go. Oh, yeah. Got another fruit. Pick it up. And throw that thing. Yeah. All right. Nice. Can we jump on here? Oh, we can. You can jump so high, Patrick. I'm amazed. So right. We you need that for these buttons. Pulls down and this button. Ooh, nice. Ooh, this looks quite dangerous. Watch out, Patrick. Those are quite pointy. Patrick, how are you going to grab that if you are standing under it? You can't jump up. What are you going to do? Your ground slam is that strong. I'm amazed, Patrick. <gasps> right. okay. pick it, pick it. Oh! 
Man, you're fast. Good thinking, Patrick. Good thing. We got the checkpoint. Nice. Back to going down. There we go. Oh, what? How did it hit you? The. Right. Let's keep moving. Let's, oh, no, again. Uh, so much. Ow. Get that underwear. That's much better. Grab that SpongeBob underwear. Patrick has no underwear because he forgets that every morning. So you just have SpongeBob underwear and wearing it. All of a sudden, he knows you need to wear underwear. Indeed. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. It does fit right. Just do it. The weight of throw fruit will also activate pressure plates. So this fruit will go on here. Ah, open the gate. Nice. Right, got that. Got more fruit. Slam that first. What's up here? More stuff to eat. Patrick can also jump on a throw fruit to get to higher places. Oh, okay. He may stack throw fruit as well by throwing a throw fruit on top of another throw fruit. We're gonna stack it like dominoes. This will allow Patrick to get to even higher places. It's quite nice. Don't forget, Patrick, it still will, so you need to still be fast. Grab that. Oh, we've done that one. Oh, yeah. Look at you, Patrick. Amazing. Throw it like there. Another one on top. Is it high enough? Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh. Whoa. Oh, it's another slide. Another slide. With. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, jump that. And jump this. Down. No, not in the fire. Ah. <laughs> Oh no, that's gonna hurt. Uh, and they're exploding, exploding. Oh, that's much better. You made it, Patrick. You even withstand fire. What are you made of, Patrick? This is freezy fruit. Patrick can pick up freezy fruit and throw it. Freezy fruit will temporarily freeze goo. Patrick can slide on frozen goo until it thaws. We can slide around, alright. Okay, I think I saw a sock. Go, Patrick, go, Patrick, go. Go, Patrick, go, Patrick, go. Oh, goody, another one. Yeah, we got the sock. Nice. Right, I got the sock, but I saw some more stuff right over here. I'm gonna throw another one. Grab that. Yeah, there it is. A purple shiny object. Nice. Run, Patrick, run. If Patrick belly flops near robots, he can damage or stun them. Small robots will simply be defeated by Patrick belly flop. Larger robots will be stunned for a short period of time. But right, go Patrick, go Patrick, belly flop time. Yeah! There you go. Now destroy the duplicator. All right? And now you need to do it one more time, Patrick. Ground pound. What's this? Patrick may also use throw fruit to defeat robots. Of course he can do that. Like that. Amazing. Pick another one up. And there, there we go. Wait for it. Pick another one up. There we go. Alright. That machine duplicates so fast. You need to stop it, Patrick. Two more. Do the belly flop, Patrick. <laughs> A robot go boom. This guy, he's stunned. Destroy him. No, what? Why is he not stunned? There we go. Oh, no. Oh, stop it. All right, they're both stunned. There we go. Grab that and throw it at the There we go. No. no. Stun this guy. Kill. Destroy it. Keep moving, Patrick. All right. Destroy this thing. The duplicator. Of course it's gonna hurt you. We're standing out so close to it. Grab it, Patrick. Golden statue. Oh boy, indeed. All right, watch out for these robots. They're gonna hurt. Yeah, grab him. Ooh, up we go. Throw him in the goo. Yes. Get your revenge. How many of these do I have to carry? Should I grab the pants now? 
Let's get out of this horrible cave. It's so dangerous. Oh, 